So thank you so much for coming out to see the Harlem Project. We're so excited that you're all here. Um, uh, the court doesn't stretch any further, so I'm going to shout. I'm talking to you all over here, and over here, and I'm just going to talk to everyone. Um, so first of all, sorry about the change of location. The weather was not on our side once again, and we figured we should just come inside and be safe from any rain that might happen. Um, so I just want to talk briefly about why, why the Harlem Project exists and why I decided to start doing this uh, three summers ago, back in 2016. Um, I wanted to design a project, a dance project, um, that, uh, that connected me to my community. So I've lived at Harlem for six years and I wanted a way to get to know the people on, on my block and on my corner. Um, and as a dancer, the way I do that is through dance. Uh, through movement and through teaching and through education. Um, and that, that really is the ethos behind the project. Um, it's grown um, in ways that I couldn't have imagined since the first time we did this. Um, so now we've, we've brought together, this year, over 70 performers to dance together. Which um, is no mean feat. Um, and so I just want to thank parents, families, who've let their young people be a part of what we're doing tonight. It's, uh, it's been quite an experience and it's always a journey from the beginning to the end. It's not just about what you see on stage, it's about where, where our young people have come in the process. Um, so just uh, I just want to give a quick list of thanks, um, really with these people, the Harlem Project would never happen. Um, so, uh, I want to firstly thank the funders of the project. So we have we have two grants, one from the Lower Manhattan Cultural Council, and they're regranting money from the New York State Council on the Arts and from the Department of Cultural Affairs. And we also had a second grant from the Upper Manhattan Empowerment Zone, um, which also is administered by the Lower Manhattan Cultural Council. They do a lot of work, uh, both organizations work to support artists like myself, um, who are, we're, we're small in terms of budget and in terms of things we can pull off. So with their support, uh, we can do things like this, so I can't thank them enough for their support. Um, also, uh, Children's Aid Society, because without without this space, we, we might be dancing out in the rain right now. So, um, they've been our original partner since the first year we did this, so I want to thank them for their hospitality towards us. Uh, also, we want to thank our other performing organizations, Covenant Ballet Theatre, who've also been with us since the first year. Um, and also new this year we have uh, Ballet and Beyond and the Goddard of Riverside Performing Arts Summer Conservatory. Um, also, of course, I want to thank the dancers of the Matthew Westerby Company because they're phenomenal people. Um, and alongside them we have our apprentice ensemble this year of uh, high school and college, either college undergrads or graduates. Um, again, another part of the Holland Project is give, giving people the experience and letting them become part of our community too. I um, also want to thank the board of directors of the company because uh, we became a non-profit a couple years ago and they've really kind of stuck with me and kind of helped form a vision and, and building our mission. Um, and I also just want to give a, a quick shout out to two community partners who've really helped us promote the project. Uh, the Marcus Valley Park Alliance, for one. And second, Uptown Grand Central, who are based up on 125th and Park Avenue. Um, both those organizations do a lot for the neighborhood. Um, so check them out online, follow them, go to their events. Um, we're very, very proud to have their, their partnership. Um, all right, having said all that, I think it's time to see some dance. So enjoy the show, and please come up and talk to us afterwards, find out who we are. Thank you.
Thank you guys for coming out.